We're here with Alexis from Creative Loafing as people are loafing around waiting for this mac and cheese. Yeah. And I know you guys are pretty much here every Sunday to really support this local market. Why is this so important for this community? Um, well, we're just everything local. So our whole paper is local. We do local events. Um, we have local deals. We just really like to support local businesses and just get people out and enjoying local things. Now, is it just me or do you smell the aroma of bubbling cheese, lots of macaroni, some special ingredients, which I can't decipher right now. And are you going to join the mac and cheese cook-off and the taste testing? Um, I would love to taste it. I'm not going to be judging or anything, but it smells amazing. And yeah, I would love to see what people come up with. You know, this is such an amazing day. And I, every single time I come here, it seems to grow bigger and bigger and bigger. This is like one of those secret gems of the city. I mean, what would you say about people who maybe are new to the city or have never experienced Seminole Heights Sunday morning market? I mean, it's amazing. It's just like a great community event. There's lots of things to do. If Even if you don't want to buy things, there's tons of people out here just giving away free stuff and just trying to get you interested in local things. That's right. Speaking of free stuff, how about Creative Bloping's table here? You can sign up to win some cool stuff. And I just want to show everyone this t-shirt. Can, can you hold that up for me, Don? Look how cute she is. Brand new t-shirt design. Who did the designs on this, Alexa? Um, our creative director, Jessica. We're doing them for all the different areas of campus. We have a Very cool. All right, you got to stop down here, pick up some t-shirts, sign up for some free goodies. There's discount tickets, all kinds of fun. And of course, we're here for the second annual mac and cheese event. I cannot wait. I'm so hungry. Help me. <laughs>